I'm a doctor, right? I'm an aesthetic doctor. So you, you know, owning a car is one thing, yeah, but knowing how to drive it is another thing. So uh, somebody hooked me up with Dennis Lien. Uh, he's a Singapore uh, Formula driver. He took me to the pump with a Porsche and he showed me a bit of the, the ropes. I somehow got uh, fancy to racing. For the race, right, you need a team. So the team doesn't require a lot of people, three to six people. This time round, it was quite interesting because and Natasha was one of them. And uh, I just called her and she sounded very friendly, very enthusiastic. Um, and I said, hey, maybe I need a few more people in my team. So it's Dennis, me, Chef James Swan, Titi Shakira, Brandon Lee, and uh, Natasha. Hi, my name is Natasha Cedar. I'm actually Malaysia's top female racing drivers. I've been in the automotive industry for over 13 years and I actually started at the age of 9 as a young go-karter. So I worked my way up through the ranks and I actually was invited to take part in the Petronas Formula Experience School or PFX for short. And I actually got a position as an official driver for Petronas. And from there I ended up taking part in becoming a GT driver at the end as well as driving for Porsche and the Asian Aston Martin team here as well. So Dr. Q reached out to me a couple days before. It was completely out of the blue and he mentioned it was a three hour a go-kart in New series actually. And you just sharing a little bit more information about it and I said that, you know what, let's take part. So we have Dennis here, so he's one of the participants in our team and he's actually going to take us through a little bit about the track itself. Yeah. On um, turn one okay. and two, had a little bit of input, tried okay. to make it a bit more flowy and, and also a little bit safer as well. Okay. But if you notice the safety barrier systems on this track, yep. it's, it's got double PDFE pipes, it's mm -hmm. fully spring loaded as well. It's a very, very safe layout. We are very cautious and, and uh, we do uh, pay attention to the, the safety aspects that when you exit the pit, yeah. please stay uh, within the plan line, do not cut it. The moment okay. you cut it, we will give you a penalty on that. I think it's going to be fun. It's going to be really fun. It's a challenging track and I think this, this is definitely one of them, especially being a one-make series uh, for this endurance race. This little section here. I'm just, I'm trying, I'm still trying to figure out how, how do you take this corner? Okay, you've got to be more precise and okay. it tightens up. And then when you get up here, it's obviously uh, a chicane, yeah. right? And it gets really tight in here. You sacrifice the, the entry going in, but yeah. it's more the exit that you want to... Absolutely. Okay, so It's cool. like any chicane, um, you know, the theory of the chicane is sacrifice the leading corners for the exit of the last. A bit nervous because it'll, it'll be my first time going out on this track. But I'm quite excited because in the in the track in the drive will be very interesting and it will be a lot of drama. I think three hours race, very long race. Anything happen. anything can happen. So exactly. doesn't mean you start last in the qualify. You can be in the, in the mid pair or you in can the even front win. pair. Yeah, exactly. exactly. So yeah. I hope that we will have a very consistent driving throughout the race. So hopefully, maybe like you said, top five. just got here, it's now qualifying. So we've got Siti Shakira going first, Brandon, and then me as a third person. The most important thing right now is to make sure that we get the lines and the track as fast as possible, keep calm, and get the fastest lap. That was just qualifying just now. Um, we did really, really well. We actually qualified six. Shakira did the fastest time, doing a 48.4, so we're really happy about that. It was good. felt like when I went out, it was, uh, there was enough space for me to breathe a little bit. So I started pushing and started feeling the car a little bit more. I uh, got a hang of it, then got caught up with some of the traffic. Yeah, so it was, it was quite a nice battle going on. We were like going back and forth. How did, how did it feel for you out there? Throughout the session just now, it was a bit very tough because the front pace was pushing me and then the back pace was pushing me. So I think if we just be consistent with this, we can be maybe like top five. Yeah. I know we can be in that pace and top five pace. So 
So here we'll be going out first for uh, for 30 minutes, 25 to 30 minutes still. Okay. And then we'll switch up drivers. And hopefully okay. that second driver can go for another 25 to 30. Okay. Um, and that would allow us... Could us... Just, just nice for a refuel. Okay, okay. Oh.